gonna share with you a what fits in my bag video. I thought I would share with you what fits in the this drawer bag. But first, let me just unveil it and let you take a closer look. So this is the Dior uh, saddle wallet on chain. It's the bigger version. There are no pockets at the back. And there's just this cute detail, very reminiscent to the saddlebag. And of course, the D hardware, whatever you call it. Take all that out. So inside we have uh, one insert pocket at the back and six card slots in front we have one zipper pocket and inside it is actually the golden chain let me just put that down and show you the last compartment in front there it is okay So the chain is in age gold hardware. I don't know if you would call this a brushed hardware or not. I'm just not sure about these kinds of things, but I'll go ahead and put this in. There, that's how it is secure. This one on the side. Let's try to put the stuff inside. Um, so, normally, in an ideal world, before all this pandemic, I would carry with me my phone. This is the Galaxy Note 4. This is actually just a model because I'm using my actual phone that I use for to film this video. So this is the Note 4. Four, I believe and I'm using a note 9 right now I would just put that in front and I have my hand sanitizer uh, lipstick this is a Mac in the spirit uh, another lipstick this is the Charlotte Tilbury I always carry two colors of lipstick whenever I'm out I don't know what it is but I'm just used to doing it like that. <laughs> and my Valentino card holder. Uh, I have cash inside and coins and the cards at the back. Um, yeah, that's the bulk of everything that I carry. Uh, these days when I'm out, I just carry my cash, uh, my phone, and sometimes the car keys I put it inside and house keys. What else? Yeah, hand sanitizer. And that's it. Not even the lipstick. Just those three essentials. Um, but whenever I'm out, like in a day or something, I would put in an extra perfume sample. This is a perfume sample from Louis Vuitton. It's called the Apogee. Put it in there. Uh, and yeah, that's it. That's it. I purchased this bag because I like the design. I've been looking at the saddlebag for quite a long time, but then I actually thought that, oh, I'm actually wanting a wallet on chain. And so why not put two and two together? And I found this. This was bought in uh, Italy, particularly in Sicily, I think. This was the last piece the SA has mentioned. And what else? Um, I don't really put my cards inside here because I don't want to have to clean, like sanitize um, the insides of the bag. Plus, this is canvas, as you can see. This is canvas. If you get dirt in there, it's very hard to clean. I would say be very particular about uh, the lipsticks, uh, the lid coming in open. 
even the hand sanitizer might spill so you just keep it upright um, I would not put any pens in here this would be good for traveling too uh, I always put a small bag inside a bigger tote if whenever I go travel and so a passport definitely fits inside if I go traveling I would take this out and replace this with a compact wallet I have here the compact wallet from Bottega Veneta that fits right into and mind you the phone is um, here so it all fits my essentials what else yeah that's pretty much it it's pretty roomy uh, if you have like a would take this out if you have a I think I just scratched it <laughs> if you have a um, what you call this a And this one, a compact wallet and the card holder. I would put my coins in here and whatnot. I think that would still be good that way. This is canvas, so it has a lot of give. That's it. There's more room here. Uh, sunglass wouldn't fit. Sunglass wouldn't fit if I have this big wallet there. And it closes pretty well. It's a side there. It's a bit bulgy here. But here. That's it. What else would you like to know? I hope this is helpful if you're trying to complement. If you're contemplating getting this bag, if you're thinking about getting this one over a Chanel walk, I hope this is helpful. Um, whenever I plan to buy a bag, I always look it up on YouTube or online, do some research about it first. And I find these kinds of videos helpful, so I hope I'm able to help you out on this one. I have another wallet here, which I... I have another wallet here, which I normally use also to go traveling. This is real leather. I purchased this in Japan absolutely beautiful it can uh, house two currencies that's why I always carry it with me if I don't carry the Bottega one I would take this out and replace it with this one but really I don't think I would need a, a separate card holder so that's it a passport would go at the back here that's it it's pretty neat actually Pretty neat. Or even here, it's since it's more secure. Put all the valuables in here, maybe like a jewelry, and you can zip it. That's it. There it goes. I hope you enjoyed the video. I hope you enjoyed the video. This is my first time doing what fits in a bag video. I hope this was helpful. I would try to insert a mod shots of how I would um, style this. Not really style, but I normally just wear a, a shirt and a jeans. That's it. Shirt and pants and whatever. Very simple. Just t-shirt and jeans. Very casual. Like that. Um, yeah. Also, uh, put in the measurements okay so i got myself a ruler let me just measure this out for you right now um this is about eight and a half inches in length the width is one and a half if it's if it's overly stretched it's one and a half um the height is just do it like that is about five and three quarters. And I just removed a chain and the chain length is 45 inches long. I'm gonna go ahead and put some um, mod shots for you.
hope you enjoyed that mod shot. Just to recap, this is the Dior Saddlebag Wallet on Chain. Um, fits. I'll just take all of the stuff that I put in so you can see what I have inside. That's it. Okay, so uh, I thought I would share with you uh, how a long wallet would fit in this bag. So I got myself my Louis Vuitton, um, I think this is the Josephine wallet. And just for comparison, show you. That way, and I'll try to fit it in, but essentially I wouldn't want to because this is actually already a wallet, but for comparison purposes, let me just try to fit it in. You might be able to relate more if I put a Louis Vuitton long wallet inside and show you if it's in there. Yeah, it does. And the phone is in here, so if you would like that kind of arrangement, you can also do it this way. Um, I also have my Louis Vuitton Victorine wallet, and it actually also fits inside. If I put it upright like that, I can fit all my other essentials as well. Keys. Car keys, uh, another small pouch would fit, so that works. Um, if I travel, I always carry this soft wallet with me. Oh, my table is getting messy right now, I'm sorry. Uh, let me just clear this out. I always carry this soft wallet with me. It has uh, two zipper but this top one actually has um two compartments left and right there so if i travel i have a i can put different currencies in one wallet and plus this one is really handy for putting other stuff such as receipt and coin so i like this so much i can put that one in put that one in slip lipstick there camera I will just sling it on my neck I have a G7X so I'll just sling it on my neck and that's it for today I think that concludes our what this in this bag video I hope you enjoy it and let me know in comments suggestions um, subscribe to my channel for more videos like this I am a certified bagaholic I hope to show you and share with you my love for bags soon in this channel. So I hope you leave your comments down below, share some love, no haters please, and comment so I, can, I know where to improve. Thank you so much. Bye.